for the Yankees, it is Clark Schmidt. The Yankees have lost each of his last four starts, and he's got an ERA of a little over six in the last four. You look forward to him for next year being in the rotation. He's he turned himself into a pretty good starting pitcher. Akil Badu will lead things off on a Wednesday night after New York won the series opener 5-1. Fly ball, right field, Stanton makes the play. There's Zach who's in right field tonight. Wind up the 2-2, two swing a line drive down the right field line into the corner. That's going to drop fair. Stanton over to field it on a couple of hots. McKinstry around first will head into second. Stanton's throw into Torres at second base. McKinstry 0 for 4 last night. 1 for 1 tonight. Hits a one out double here in the first. Here's their RBI leader, Spencer Torkelson. Swinging a soft little tap down the first baseline. That'll be fielded by Schmidt. An easy lob down to first to LeMahieu to get Torkelson by a couple of steps. Just a little dribbler out to the right of home plate. McKinstry over to third. A chance to strike early for Kerry Carpenter, who was really good last night on the month multi-hit game for Carpenter. Base hit to left. Carpenter comes through again. He's given the Tigers the early lead. This is a perfect example of how you do it. Here's Matt Veerling. Runner goes. Yeah, 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 yeah. Did he go? Yes, he did. So Veerling down on strikes. But the Tigers get a run on two hits. One man left on base. Second straight start for Matt Manning against New York. Six shutout innings against the Yankees did not get bigger into the decision. LeMayu at 241, 15 homers, 38 RBIs. Hit shortly and through for base hit past Veerling. And a leadoff single for LeMayu. Judge at 264, 31 homers, 58 RBIs. Missed off the plate, just missed. McManning wants that call. So first and second, nobody out, and that'll bring up Jason Dominguez. And gets it up the middle on the charge short. Just one play to first. Both men move up, one away. Fastball swinging a miss. Wow. What was that? Kelly was setting up high, and then it was like a quick pitch, and Torres just flailed at 94 away. Off Manning. He gloved it and tosses him out. Let's hope he's all right. He's a little dejected, that's for certain. But boy, he was able to gather himself on the mound and throw out Stan. That ball that hit Manning off the bat of Giancarlo Stanton was hit at 119 and a half miles an hour. It's Bo Brisky who takes over, and they will need some innings out of him in his 20th appearance. First pitch is popped up to left field. Austin Wells retired to start the second. To the left side, Veerling bobbled it for a moment, regroups, and throws him out thanks to the stretch from Torkelson. Hung with it on a ball that popped out of his glove and gets Volpe, pretty good runner, by about a half a step. Here is Parazza, a right-hand hitter. The 3-2, swung on and hit in the air to left field, shallow, and it drops in for a base hit. Too far out for short and too far in for Badu. So Parazza gets a two-out hit. And he works a four-pitch wall. So first and second, two outs, and that brings up D.J. LeMayu. That one is looped into right field. It is a base hit. Peraza will score. Cabrera moves to third. It's a game-tying RBI single for D.J. LeMayu, and it's 1-1. And that is a typical D.J. LeMayu hit. Brisky now has to face Aaron Judge. Zach Short will take the out at second. Yankees able to tie it up on D.J. LeMayu's RBI single. Bottom of the third inning, Dominguez, Torres, and Stanton. And the Martian will lead off against Bo Brisky. Now it is drilled deep to right field. His first Yankee Stadium home run. An absolute bullet. And the Yankees lead 2-1. to one. That might be his first Yankee Stadium home run, but his third in this short career. He's liking his big league stuff. Uh, you know what? He likes the lights here. Back-to-back -back free passes. Second straight walk for Bo Brisky after giving up the leadoff homer in the inning. So there are two. So here's Peraza and the pitch. Line into right center field. That is going to be a base hit. Cut off in the gap by McKinstry. Torres will score. It's an RBI double for Peraza, and the Yankees lead 3-1. to one. And Jose Cisnero forced into action for the second time in his many days. Ground ball to first base. Torkelson will grab it over to the bag, touch it with his left foot. Jose Cisnero gets the final out of the third inning. Bottom of the fourth inning, 3-1 Yankees. Judge 0 for 1 with a walk. Ripped into right center field. That ball is going to be in there. And it goes all the way to the wall. Judge is going for two. He's going to make it. Jason Dominguez, who was grounded out and hit a bullet home run. That one is looped into left field. It is a base hit. Good read by Judge, but he'll stop at third. Another hit for Dominguez. And the Yankees have runners on the corners with one out. And here is Glaber Torres. Grounded up the middle and through for a base hit. Judge 
scores. Dominguez will stop that second. It's an RBI single for Torres, and the Yankees lead four to one. Left side could be two. It is inning over. Yankees gain another. Clark Schmidt has been dealing since the first. No base runners. McKinstry, it's a high pop to shallow right center. There's Stanton to make the catch. 16 in a row retired by Clark Schmidt. Now oh, two nine, and here is Judge. The two one. Judge hits a ground ball wide, a third base hit left field. And in the shortstop hole, stung, so it went through the hole. Judge had walked, grounded out in doubles, so that's his second hit. So here's Dominguez from the right side against the lefty Holton. And another base hit. A three hit night for the rookie. First and second, two men out. Torres in the air, left field. Badu is there. And Holton strands two. 16 in a row. Since the first inning, he got the final out of the first, and then it's been one, two, three since then. Base hit Good out of the around. reach of a diving Volpe in the left field. A leadoff single for Spencer Torkelson. That snaps Clark Schmidt, retiring 16 in a row. To the right side, and Verling's got his first hit of the night. Go the other way, sneaks through the infield. Two on, tying run to the plate. Anya's at the plate. Swing a line drive, base hit into center field. Torkelson around third. He will be, oh, he ran through the stop sign. He is going to score as the throw is cut off on the infield by Clark Schmidt. Scores easily, runners at the corners, and the Tigers now trail at 4-2. to Wande Peralta is the new pitcher for the Yankees, lefty. Meadows in the air, right center field. Let's see if Veerling Go. tags. Go. Dominguez behind it. Veerling does tag. The throw comes into second. It's a sacrifice fly for Parker Meadows. The Tigers are within a run. The bases are loaded with Tigers. And Aaron Boone has seen enough from Wandy Peralta. Greg Weiser comes on. Veerling, one for three in the game. The one-two. Swing and it's got him. Got a fastball by him. Weiser comes on and does the job as the Tigers leave. The base is loaded. And now Clay Holmes try to nail down his 18th save in 21 opportunities. Yankees one out away from a five-game winning streak. Got him. And the Yankees win four to three. They've won five in a row. They've taken eight of their last nine. They have moved over 500 at 70 and 69.